It's Faye. Dude, I almost spent $6,286 on viral TikTok things that you guys been raving about. But here's how I actually finessed and saved $6,134 for practically the same thing. Think smarter. Not harder. I'm all about looking and smelling like luxury, but for like a fraction of its cost. Here's how to save a pretty penny. I am so excited for this collab because Dasie was kind enough to hook your girl up with some of the most highest rating dupes in the perfume world. I've actually known of Dasie a long time ago. Inspired by Chanel's Chance Eau de Parfum. Yes, your girl speaks French. Mademoiselle. For $105, why? Instead, you can get the Woody Hyacinth from Dossier for $29. 29! And you can smell just as luxurious. Girlies! I wouldn't waste any more money, especially 105 on another Chanel perfume like the Gabrielle Eau de Parfum, when I can have the exact thing from Dossier for $29 again, guys. That is a dupe. Ugh. The floor Lane Lane carries notes like lily, blackberry, grapefruit, orange blossom, jasmine, and musk. Listen, Linda, if you love collecting and smelling like money, designer, luxury, high-end, Dossier is your affordable bestie. Any scent is $39, although all of these were $29 each, while designer scents range from $50 to $280 in retail. Who has that kind of money laying around for perfume? Oh my god, this brings me back to when all my influencer friends were designer scents, and so I thought I had to fit in. I got a Gucci scent for like $200 something. I used it for the weekend and never touched it again. Anyway, the bigger the better. Dasi is offering bulk deals up to 25% discount and free shipping on 3 plus bottles. And if you don't believe me or this isn't your taste, hey, free returns and exchanges forever. Sign me up. Honestly, as a small business owner myself, I can really appreciate that they're always adding new scents to their collection and they're thrilled to hear suggestions from you guys and me for future release. A brand listening to their customers and appreciating their time and their critiques is a brand I can respect. With my code FAYE10, you can save even more. The link's down below. What are you waiting for? These are not called dupes for no reason, Linda. Adding to dupes that healed my wallet and you won't regret because I'm telling you the secret. Of course, Dossier Citrus Green Apple for $29 inspired by Dutch and Cabana light blue. That retails for $105 and you can sit over there. If I'm being really honest, this reminds me of when I was in Korea. All the girlies I became friends with have this adult womanly fragrance. The best way to describe this perfume is feminine and powerful. However, very light. Ooh, and also I had a roller from Etude House that had this sweet peach scent. It's this. This just smells so pretty. That's the perfect way to describe it. And that's how you get the boys, at least in Korea. Another dupe is Dazi's Floral Pure for $29 inspired by Jo Malone's English Pear in Frisia that runs for $100. Oh my god, this has like pear and watermelon. It lies around the woody musk amber area. I honestly don't know how this concoction is made and set for that little of money compared to $100 luxury. Floral Pear really embodies youthful luxury, trust fun baby. This next dupe has been getting out of hand. Instead of the Skims Outdoor Mid-Thigh Bodysuit, for $78. Everyone and their besties are going for this Fenerg woman's bodycon sexy jumper romper thing for $24.99. The skims are sold out everywhere, but I read that your thigh literally feels like a squeezed can of biscuits for most girls who aren't miss size zero to four. So basically most of us would have hated the juncture that squeezes into your thighs and your hamstrings. Okay, I'm not a huge fan of this bodycon jumpsuit because I'm super insecure about my shape. However, in terms of comfort it literally conforms to your thigh, especially if it's jiggly and mine are. You literally won't have any restrictions in the inner thighs. It's so soft, bouncy, and stretchy, and it's snug enough that it doesn't shift around your leg. You can actually concentrate on an activity instead of like always pulling like an inner wedgie. It doesn't snap at the crotch, but it's hard to tell for me because I have a thickety chickety there. Which can be kind of painful. In my experience with skims, that's literally what it is. That thing digs up until you can feel it in your bones. This is comfortable fee for bigger girls like me who are super aware of their bodies in public especially if you want to dress this out um i do see where this can be a dupe it's hard to say because i wouldn't wear bodysuits like this in public anyway if you're into luxury jewelry aka cartier their love ring that sits its booty at a thousand eight hundred and thirty dollars get ready to have the exact ring for 16.98 again i'm testing and buying viral dupes recommended on tiktok and this ring got everyone talking this ring feels lighter and wrong to wear because it's so similar but if you're a baddie on a budget no one can tell the difference in my opinion this is a 18k titanium steel hypoallergenic and never fades or loses its luster it does have a really nice polishing on the outside and the inside of the ring so it's super smooth it makes me feel like a con artist but i feel so powerful 
Oh my god, these have been talked everywhere on social media since like 2001. The Ari Rail Me High Waisted Crossover Leggings that run for $44.95 were sold out everywhere. And Ari is expensive, okay? I remember getting excited too because girls who looked like me were raving about how insane their waist snatched all because of the crossover layout. Instead, these are the We Fleece Best V Cross Waist Leggings for women and tummy control. For $11.99, you can literally have the same leggings. In my experience, so far, they're not too see-through, which I like because some leggings can do that to you. I can't compare directly how the real ones feel like. It is made with athletic materials. So it has a light compress to it, which I do like. Buttery soft. It does feel like it's a little loose on me. Maybe I should have sized down, but girl, the best part, it doesn't fall while running or walking or anything of that. It doesn't roll down. It hugs your hips. It has really good tummy control, and it could be better if the legging was a little thicker. I just like how it doesn't roll down, okay? That's all I care about. The Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk is iconic. Every one of their moms have this lipstick, like since 2014. And now you can too, for $4.97 instead of $34. But let's see if this dupe is worth the hype. It's the Revlon Super Luxurious Matte Lipstick called Pick Me Up. This is sensationally the same. According to beauty gurus, I have one on the bottom and one on the top, and I bet you couldn't even tell. Also, I heard it's a good dupe for the MAC lipstick in color Angel. The only difference I've noticed in terms of formula or texture is that the Charlotte Tilbury is way more creamier. The Revlon one is not as moisturizing. But for the price, you can wear your Revlon every single day until it's gone because it's that affordable. Trust me when I say I'm going to be buying this Revlon one. Okay, so here's another viral dupe that gets me excited. Anything to take down those skin prices usually shake the crowd. This Skims cotton jersey, long sleeve or tea, or whatever you want to call it. $54 alone for like a plain tea. These QQQ women's three piece long sleeves are $39.99 altogether, which you can get three for less. I don't really understand at first why these are duped because the Skims one is definitely all cotton. These have a more cooling ribbing spandex sensation to it. If it's super snug, it has a stretch and it's like a soft stretch too. This is a lot thicker than I expected and it's like the breathable thick. It's honestly perfect to layer it down as a base for colder weather. They're like good quality in their own ways because I can't compare the texture. You really can't. It's like a different fabric. The great thing about both is that the material does not look cheap. Another interesting dupe that I didn't expect to go viral is the Pacifica Dream Moon Spray. It runs for $21.99 in comparison to Ariana Grande's Cloud that runs for $45. Okay. So here's the tea. All the single baddies know that Ariana Grande Cloud got viral because it's the perfect, sweet, feminine, girly pop and super attractive scent. And I got it for that exact reason because your girl was single and apparently you get a lot of compliments when you wear it from the bowl. It has been over a year since I put on that perfume. It's a little too sweet for my taste now. The Pacifica Beauty Dream Moon Spray is not that long lasting compared to the Cloud. It kind of has a very, very premature, youthful scent to it. Not like these babies. Just quickly for perspective, Dacia perfumes smell more mature, sexy, and like flirty attraction. While the cloud and the dream mood is a little bit like teenager, high school teenager. Like the scent is cute. I will say the Pacifica do feels easier to wear than the Cloud. They're super similar. Save yourself half the price. Our last dupe of the day. I actually had for a long time without me even noticing. This is the Perfunry saddle shoulder bag or clutch for $29.99 dupe for Dior's saddle bag for $4,200. I saved myself $4,170. Books. Mine has this small nail head trim, but there's a version that's actually plain that's more similar to Dior's. However, the shape is exactly the same. It's big enough to keep like your wallet, phone, and like a couple makeup items in. It's super trendy. You can choose like to wear it shoulder wise or cross body wise because it does come with an extra strap. Does it have the best quality to it? I mean, like if you're comparing to Dior, if you're comparing it to like Target or Urban Outfitters, the same. The same. Because it's such a unique dupe, I think you either really like it or you really don't like it. I personally think it's so so, but overall, I like it more than I don't. So that's good. It's a very unique taste. So if you do want the Dior bag, but you don't want to spend $4,000 because that's a down payment for something, get this bag. That is it with me testing viral dupes. You go on, finesse, and save a pretty penny. Okay, gotta go. Bye. Even if you try, you wouldn't understand it.